John from Jolly John's here. Today I want to show you a new build called the Wookie Build. It's been out for a little while, but it's been recently updated. The Wookie Build, uh, it's fantastic for families. It has a lot of sports content, um, large fonts, easy to read and very easy to navigate. Uh, it's got uh, many of the popular add-ons and most of them seem to be working without a problem. It seems to be fairly regularly maintained as well. Um, it's not what I would consider the best build out there, but for a family environment, it's certainly one of the best and well worth a look at. So let's have a look at the Wookiee build. Well, this is it guys. This is the Wookiee build in action. Um, as you see, I've only just installed this build. Um, I'll go through and show you how to install it after video. It's a pretty neat little build for Cody. Fairly popular lately. Uh, we'll have a quick run through it, then I'll show you how to install it. Obviously this is power on off system. That's where you go to install new add-ons and so forth. Your add-ons, programs, videos, music. So you'll find all your video add-ons in there, program add-ons and music add-ons. So your Exodus and so Phoenix, uh, Specto and all that should be in there. Here we have the build info, TV shows. So you have your Salt TV, Zen TV, Series, 1, 2, 3, Specto TV, Lucky TV, Pandora, TV Mix, Yes TV and Royal Wii TV. Now as you may be aware, may not be, depends on how familiar you are with Cody. Some of these live stream um, add-ons uh, can be temperamental at times. They sometimes work, sometimes don't. Um, they may go down for a period of time and then come back several months later later this is on the live tv ones as you can see here uk turks it's probably the most popular one at the moment uh tv streams tv ultra ip tv free view gobble this is fairly extensive the list there fitness add-ons has quite a bit here uk turk fitness they've done a fantastic job in separating the different categories so you don't have to go scrolling through here's the exodus add-on and once again they're separated into different categories so movies channels networks box office tv shows in theater my movies search my tv calendar sports this is fantastic for anyone who is really after a box for sports uh, or cody for sports as you can see, there's a good, li a good list of add-ons. Zem, Hello, Find My Game, Soccer, Sports, Sporty. As it list goes on sports level, it's fairly reliable. Streams TV, Phoenix Sports, another reliable one, such as UK TV Sports. There's more there, Sanctuary. Again, some quite a few good add-ons there. Um, I've used some of these myself, Maverick TV. Um, it's quite, it's a fantastic build. Movies, this is more what I'm interested in. Um, Salt, Silent Hunter, Zen, Real Movies. I have got uh, tutorials on how to install many of these um, add-ons separately. Uh, if you're not after a build, um, you can check up on how to install these add-ons, which I've got um, many of them of. Phoenix, which is another popular um, add-on similar to Exodus and Salts and Specto. It's got a lot. The Kids Zone, fantastic if you have children in the house. Um, Turk Tunes, obviously from UK Turks. Lego. It's quite a quite a good selection there. Bob. Blues Place, Costa Valhalla. Again, very good selection of categories. Music. Plenty of good selection for different music streams. UK Turk. This is a very good pot, good add-on. If you've got 3D TV, um, or if you're using a mobile phone and you have a uh, VR box, fantastic. Um, your movies, stand-up, it's got all the categories laid out just as it does in the add-on. And fantastic. Um, yeah, so this is it. It's a very well-built add-on it's laid out really well nice big uh, menu icons uh, you, you can see it's um, 
definitely not difficult to use very easy to get through it's, um, it's more family friendly than many other builds out there which have pawn options and so forth it's well worth having a play with and looking at um, it's uh, it, it's pretty quick too um, it is a 300 meg file as you saw as you'll see when we download it um, but the build itself is running very well um, we'll just have a quick look uh, we'll go to something from Exodus TV shows we've got people watching Vikings Season 4 and we'll go to episode 19 so it operates just like Exodus normally does taking a little bit longer than it normally does to get those streams here and there we go so you have a HD streams as normal now one thing I have noticed is a lot of times the HD streams on Exodus are not actually HD we'll have a look at this first one and I, if I can I'll show you what I mean fingers crossed it is HD stream to one which is the standard definition stream doesn't matter it'll still be watchable seriously on fight I wanted to marry you I'm already married everything I've done I've done for you you have seen all you needed to they are not as safe as they think they are the greatest army okay. ever assembled our instruments of wrath Ivar wants to leave the army he thinks our father should and that's what it looks like so we can just go back and go back to the home screen and that is that is it pretty good build it's definitely worth having a try I mean if uh, it, it honestly doesn't take that long to install most of the time that you will spend installing it will be downloading it uh, which you can just set, forget, come back and hook her up, you'll have a brand new build. Um, okay, so I'll, next I'll show you how to install this Wookiee build and you'll be impressed at how easy it is. Okay, so let's get into how to install the Mega's Wookiee build. Okay, first of all we're going to go over to uh, system now you've got to make sure first of all that you've got a fresh install of Kodi so delete um, your current install installation of Kodi and download install a brand new version so to install this um, Wookiee build we first I go to system file manager click add source select none enter the URL make sure it is entered correctly HTTP colon slash slash Wookiees pmc.com forward slash whiz then hit done you can give it a name by clicking the box under it so whiz is what's come up from the URL so if you want to change it you can just click it enter something else and click done then click OK now we go back to the home screen click on system add-ons install from zip file then you select the folder that your file you just created which is whiz click me so come to the wookie zip 
and we just have to wait for it to be download uh, download the zip file. We should get an add-on notification enabled shortly. Okay, so there we have the add-on enabled notification, and you'll get this little prompt up. We just click close. Go back to the home screen again. We select programs. Select Wookie. It says welcome to the Wookie. Select one of the options below. So I'm just going to select install Wookie. And I'm going to select a new look. Wookie. Wookie light would be ideal for low-end devices such as fire sticks and so forth. I'm just going to select new, look Wookie, and then click install. And then it's just gets this little prompt here. I'm sure you have cleared data first. And then click continue. And we just leave it to download. Okay, fruit of magic of video editing. I'm just going to fast forward this. I'm sure no one wants to sit down for the next 10 minutes watching this download and install. Uh, this will just skip forward a hell of a lot. Okay, so this is downloaded a lot quicker than I thought it was going to. Uh, obviously, my net is working a bit faster tonight than most other nights. Um, just about done. Once it's finished downloading, it should install the new version of the build. And once it's completed, you're going to have to force close Kodi. So if you're operating on like a Fire Stick or an Android device, you'll have to remove the power um, or physically turn it off, shut it down, uh, then power it back up, launch Kodi, and it should be a brand new Wookie build. And it's pretty good. I'll just wait for it to finish off installing once it's uh, finished installing I'll quickly boot it up so we can have a quick look at the new build let's move on quite nicely um, obviously lower end devices are going to be a little bit slower I've got a pretty good PC here okay so this is the brand new build for Cody the Wookie one uh, obviously it's pretty uh, focused on Star Wars um, you will get a few of these pop-ups requesting, you know, asking if you want to disable add-ons and so forth after installs, and it will go through a series of updates, um, any add-ons that need updating. Okay, well, I hope you found the tutorial helpful. Uh, this is a pretty cool build, it's worthwhile looking at. Alright, thanks for watching. Until next time.